There's a lot of effort. Yeah. <coughs> you just hear me clap and you're like... <laughs> and you're like... <laughs> yeah. You're like, man, what? I've seen it done. <laughs> I've heard it done. I've heard yeah. it done. <laughs> yeah. Hello, everyone. This is Alec. I'm Ryan. And I'm Isaac. And we are friends. First and foremost, best of buddies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and me and Isaac are brothers. But we are kind of the uh, the sole fireplace team. The the big the big boys. I guess the big cheeses of fireplace. I realized we've never really explained to our audience um, what fireplace is or what uh, we want it to be um, and the vision of it. So. This is that video, and if you're not interested, then you will not like the rest of the video. So just <laughs> go watch some of the funny videos. But Fireplace started in, with me and Isaac. Just, um, I think we watched like a Wes Anderson movie or something, and we're like, let's make a short film. <laughs> and so we, we made this little short film called Sneeze Fart. I guess it's more of a comedy video. And that was the first thing we ever made just with our cousins who were living with us. And I had a lot of fun doing it. Isaac had a lot of fun doing it. And so I was like, let's make another one. So we made a little short film called Bored with me and Isaac in it and our sister helped shoot it. And that was really fun. And oh yeah, we did the cruising. That was That's in 2015, by the way. And if yeah. you want to blast from the past, those videos are on the channel. They hold up still. well. They, hold they up. still That's, kind of hold up. That's some solid quality. Yeah, if you want to see a really young Alec, and go back really all the Isaac. way to the bottom. <laughs> yeah, all the way to the bottom yeah. and watch them. They hold up. Yeah. yeah. So this is before we met Ryan, um, and we kind of lost steam a little bit. I was 15, so 14, and Isaac. It's tough. I was busy <laughs> wrecking <stuff>. my life. <laughs> yeah. So uh, we took a long break, and then um, I got very sad and decided to write a movie <laughs> when I was 16. That movie ended up becoming Doofuses, which we made in the summer of 2000, or spring of 2018. That kind of just brought the gang back together. It was like, I got the script, I think we can do it, I got a schedule, I just kind of planned everything, and I got Isaac on board. I wrote it thinking he would be in the part and be in the part. So we made it and it was super fun, like the most fun I've had in my life maybe <laughs> and entered it into a few film festivals it, it won the local film festival and then we released it on YouTube and got a very good reaction from you guys and seemed like everyone really liked it which made my heart very happy I think before we released it in between making it and having released it I decided I wanted to start making YouTube videos every week to see if I could do YouTube as a career eventually down the road and I started making history videos Oh yeah, baby. Which are no longer available to watch. <laughs> Those are not on the channel. <laughs> you can't see them because they're terrible and I don't know why I did that. But you make mistakes and you learn from them. And so we started, I started releasing comedy videos because that is way more fun and what I'm actually passionate about. And was just making those on my own for the first little while. Um, Doofuses came out in between there. We had like 200 subscribers, it was awesome. And then <laughs> met Ryan. Mm -hmm. My best friend. He was just very aggressive about being a part of the whole process, which I appreciated. And the first video we made together was Skinny John. Yeah. And but, fun fact, if you want to see his real first appearance. Oh yeah, yeah. His real first, like, not big, but he oh, was in yeah. there. Some of you might remember I was doing a project called Moose and Covering pop song yeah. and I was like it was right when we met Ryan and I was like come hey, be in it you play bass and I need so you to, the yeah. guy with the long hair in like in the kitchen standing in the window playing bass that's, that's Ryan that's that was me. his first real <laughs> that was my opinion. appearance on fireplace yeah, <laughs> yeah. I always forget <laughs> Ryan like took me and Isaac to lunch and he was like <laughs> Okay, I know we just met, but what is Fireplace? Explain it to <laughs> What's the big idea? So we did, and he was like, okay, I'm in. Yeah. And <laughs> since then... I didn't even say, can I? <laughs> I like, realized what that. do I need to do? <laughs> well, since then we've pretty much done everything all together as a team, and Ryan was definitely an essential piece that we didn't know we needed. Since then it's been growing and you know the comedy videos have gotten better and better I think. Skinny John 
like did really well in the first one we did together. So yeah. I was like, we gotta keep doing this. <laughs> Can you say anything about? Oh that? yeah, and we made Fall, and yeah. we're really happy with. That right, was our first guess, short film all was, together. We had a huge yeah. crew. Yes, mm -hmm. and a great, great acting team and directing. And it was, it was the first time we felt very supported, and it wasn't just me and I doing everything. It was we got to kind of focus on our different jobs, and so yeah, the. Uh, the kind of vision of Fireplace that I wanted to tell you guys is uh, I want it to grow, we all want it to grow and be more than just um, my stuff, more than just Isaac's stuff, and more than just Ryan's stuff or any of that. We want it to be us all working together to try to make something bigger than our individual stuff work. Just putting it all in the same place so that we can kind of share whatever audience we gain or just help each other out. And we're obviously all involved in helping each other's creativity come out. So it's just, Fireplace is pretty much just a home for me and all my friends' art if they want it to be there because we just like helping each other and it's really fun. And that's what I want it to be forever if we get to do it forever. Mm -hmm. so. I think that makes sense, but you can talk yeah. about the Yeah, yeah, and I, I, I uh, the only thing I want to say is I think it's super apparent. If you're ever like, why doesn't America Scream have its own channel, or why doesn't this this separate? That's like, I think that was one of the things that drew me, because there was many, already a few different things happening mm -hmm. with the fireplace, because Isaac was doing mm -hmm. moose stuff, and then it was like, short, the, I had seen Doofuses was on there, but also he was doing his comedy videos, and it was like, it was already felt like a like a chase a place for many things like a channel mm -hmm. and not just one singular focused thing and mm -hmm. it's nice to go to one place and get many mm -hmm. instead of having to go to that different place. And so. if you don't like the other stuff, you don't, don't have watch it. To watch it. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. So future stuff is just what else is coming to fireplace and just the direction we're going. And some of that stuff is um, new American screen music. Um, we are on a small break, but only for the sake of so that we can gas up and get ready for 2021. Mm -hmm. 2020 has been a year. Woo! <laughs> but we have put yeah. out. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? It's been normal for me. Um, we have worked, American Scream has worked super hard this year, and um, we're getting ready for a lot of new stuff. I hope you are too. Isaac put out an EP um, on Spotify, and it isn't on the channel yet. It'll right. be coming soon. Yeah, it'll we be coming got soon. plans yeah. for that too. Yeah. Um, Roland McFury. Yes. Roland McFury is the artist name. Super good. If you're looking for some you time, that's some R and R. Just oh. you though. That's that like alone stuff. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. so, you want to get sad? It's really good. That's but it's where I, it takes you. It's not our fault. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're I not responsible. Cried multiple times listening to it on separate occasions. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I Which I haven't told that. <laughs> That's really sweet. Yeah. I, I think the first two songs have squeezed a tear out of my left eye a few times. Oh gosh. Yeah. Yeah. I've sat in the tub, lights off and all that. <laughs> and I'm just like... <laughs> yeah, if you want to take a trip through, you know, through like I say, said, I was busy wrecking my life a few <laughs> years ago, so if you want to take a little 14 minute trip through those two years, that's what that EP is. Yeah. So, that's coming. Lots of new stuff with that. I'm sure you guys have seen Mina. She did a cover of our song, Katie. If you were watching then, one of, I think the last Moose video to come out, it was uh, both of you. Yeah, we did a cover together in um, the middle. Really good. It's really, really good. She's uh, very talented. Yeah, the combination of Isaac and her singing is quality. You have to dig a little bit, but it's quality. And her cover of Katie was better than ours. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a lot better than ours. Um, she's really talented. She just released a song think, last yeah. Friday. I love, I love you good night. Yep. Um, really good. I think it yeah. just crossed a thousand Doesn't listens not too long ago. Yeah. It's doing pretty good. It's a really good song. Very sweet. She's put out quite a bit of music. Very... Don't sets the mood, I'll say that. She's all... coming to the channel. Yes. Oh, yeah, 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 that's what I'm trying to say. She's also coming, you'll see more of her, um, and like Alec was saying, we're open our arms to many other artists, um, and you'll just have to see who those artists are. <laughs> um, we want to give a place for people to feel free, because um, we all have that thing that we feel, this is us, and Fireplace is that place to feel 
this is me and I'm free doing it. There's things coming for all of us and you'll see people being free. There will be, as you know, weekly comedy videos. Those aren't gonna stop. Always. We take small breaks, but they're always coming. Um, we're always working on those and short films. Alec usually has a few always up his butt. Yeah. There will be short films being made. Yeah. So just mm -hmm. watch Fall again if you get antsy. There's a lot of things coming and on their way and a lot of people involved in that. Yeah. So get excited. There's a lot of new things coming to Fireplace. Yeah. So, um, as some of you probably saw already, last week we released uh, Fall, which is our most recent uh, short film. Fireplace is about telling stories, and, and that takes a lot of medium, or different mediums, but um, the short films are really when all of us come together probably in the most complete way. Um, and the guys wanted me to talk about this part, because you guys probably on the channel see me mostly just in the music stuff. And that is accurate. I do like lead a lot of that stuff and Alec leads the comedy videos. And there are areas that we lead up, but when it comes to the short films, it's like we're all like just interlocked. Yeah, Isaac's <laughs> really talented. All the shots that you've seen, the crisp, the movements, all the solid cinematography, here. Color grading, he's doing that stuff. He's what, he, his eye is what you're seeing. Mm -hmm. That's what you're seeing, and it's and it's very important that you know that. <laughs> Alec is doing directing and he's handling the, the managing everything, and Isaac's working all of those beautiful shots that you see. <laughs> and Ryan's carrying the both of us <laughs> on that. <laughs> So, yeah, you wonder how I get that movement. I'm holding the camera and Ryan's just like, <laughs> I'm riding on his back. We have done a shot on his <laughs> yeah. shoulders. Yeah. yeah. But. That's a wonderful thing and we're so happy to hear that you love that stuff because I, f I feel like the short films and whatever full lengths that we choose to do in the future are the truest representation of all of us coming together to make something and we're just pouring ourselves into it. So thank you one more time. I'd say something really cool. You guys are just now seeing fall, but fall has the way that short films work and the, the film festival circuit, like it's been done for over a year now, a year yeah. and a half. Um, some of you were saying, you need to enter this in a film festival or competition. And I can happily tell you, we have been and for the last year. And it actually did want win, uh, what city? When? Uh, it was Raleigh. Raleigh. So it did win one, um, and we're really proud of that. Yeah. One judge's choice, which was kind of a overall care, uh, category. We're, we're happy to finally get it to you. I'm yeah. sure it's like, whoa, this is new. Where'd this come from? And yeah. like, funny enough, there's already another short film that's done and finished and it'll yeah. be running on the next uh, circuit. And so unfortunately that means it's almost a year before our audience gets to see it. But I think you will really enjoy seeing We're we're still in that early phase where almost every thing we put out is leaps and bounds better than, than the first thing. Yeah. Um, so if you liked Fall, we're so excited for you to see the things that have already been filmed and we're really excited for this new adventure where you can take part in making more, more short films, more comedy, more music happen. We don't want to be cliche or whatever, but we have started a Patreon. Yo! Finally. Finally. Yeah. Um, I know you guys have just been itching to give us money. <laughs> yeah. are they going to ask for my I money? I just have all of this <laughs> money. Yeah, we are excited to start it. Obviously, we don't want to like beat anything to death. You guys know why artists start Patreons at this point. Yeah. Um, it is for those of you who um, who have been commenting on the short films, our, our faithful comedy video watchers, maybe our fans of American Scream out there and all the music we been putting out. This is your moment to be a part of Fireplace and in a way become part of the team and help us do those things because some people don't know but like there's a lot of logistical things like even entering into film festivals it costs money for almost every single festival we submit to mm -hmm. and if you didn't know if you couldn't catch by uh, well I don't know. We're poor. Yeah. We don't have a lot of money. You see what I look like? 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> I sold part of my ear. <laughs> Maybe you watch some of our music videos or you've seen some of our short films and, and you think like, wow, they must have a big production team or a budget or we have no budget except like the little money that we have in our bank accounts. Fireplace is also just like founded on how can we creatively make the best thing that we possibly can. So I've, I've heard some comments and, and we're so flattered if you think that we spent lots of money on the music videos or on like fall as a production. You would be surprised. Um, but the truth is no, <laughs> no. we didn't. And we rely <laughs> completely on each other's talent and each other's help. And, fr just and friends, just a lot of our friends. All of our crew is volunteers. And that's been beautiful. And if you were to support us and give to us, that's something like we don't really plan on changing. We we are still about what is the most affordable way that we can like beautifully tell a story. And so all of your money and support would go towards helping us submit to more festivals, helping us rent gear for the next shoot. And if we have a very talented actor like we had some in yeah. fall, give them a little something to say thank you so much for being willing to come do this. Yeah, so I'm sure we'll, we'll have the link uh, down in the description of this video. Head over there, I won't get into the details of how it all works, most of you know how Patreon works anyways. Yeah, so go to our Patreon if you want to. Come, yeah. come join Fireplace. Yeah. yeah. Be a part of the team. Yeah. We have so much, like we are not at a lack of ideas or content. If you wanted to give, what it would do is just help us be able to get our ideas to you faster. Yeah. Because we won't have to work at our jobs and save up for a long time before we can make another short film. It would, it would just accelerate the speed at which we get things to you. So. Mm -hmm. Thank you for watching this long video. Yeah. That hopefully will be entertaining. <laughs> yeah. I'll have to figure that out.